just about to get started. In a few moments. Uh, I think we should be good. So. Hello, everyone. That's not my intro. Oi, mateys! I'm CyberCN, and welcome back to Minecraft. Minecraft. For the last day this week, uh, we're going to be hopping right back into survival world with the nether fortress right ne right there. So I don't often have to do this, but before we get started, I'm going to call out uh, thank you to everybody that followed between the last stream and this one, uh, which is JGVR. E re no, JGV Recab. That's how you would say that. Simon from, uh, and then Simon and Zooey from Squish's streams, which is very epic. All right, time to get blaze rods, find 12 ender eyes in the fortress chest, and beat the dragon for the first time. Yes! Here we go. I almost forgot to stream... Shout out to my mom for reminding me to stream. <laughs> I'm serious. I was on my computer working on fan fiction and my mom was like, are you supposed to be streaming right now? And I was like, yeah. So I ran down here and got set up in less than five minutes, which uh, I am pretty impressed by. So I also need an enchanting room, which I'm going to get set up. But maybe we should uh, hop into the nether right before my uh, my boots break. Though first I will check on my animals. Look, I completely lost track of time. We were making muffins. Well, my mom was making muffins and I was offering witty commentary from the couch. But we were doing that and so I hadn't been on my computer in a while. So I just got back on and then I got distracted by what I was doing and completely forgot that I do, in fact, do this sort of thing. <laughs> Sorry. Whatever, it all worked out. I'm here now. Witty commentary. Yeah. That's what I do. You think this is only what I do when I stream? No, this is what this is what living with me is like. To deal with my uh, my amazing jokes. Also, I do have Optifine on today. It worked, yay! But there is still lag around the chickens because there's so many chickens. Being a streamer is a lifestyle. That's very true. Uh, if anybody knows the, the Slimesicle video coming out where he's like talking about be, uh, coming out as a gamer. Yeah, absolutely. That. Exactly. Is it lagging only for me? I mean, away from the chickens? I didn't notice any lag, but it, it might just be that I'm used to it. Oh, I spawned a chicken on here. Get in there. Get in there. I don't know, it might be. Oh. My Minecraft does still have a little bit of lag when Optifine is on. Just depending on what I'm doing. It's not the- it's not the perfect computer. Like there- see there's a little bit of lag over here, but it's not- it's not as bad as it- as it is without Optifine. Cause I don't have one of those fancy gaming computers. Sadly. It's good enough to stream. I just- I work with it. Uh, 
if I manage to somehow turn this into some sort of, uh, some form of job, I might be- I will probably get a, a, a better computer somewhere in the future, but at the moment, as this is just a hobby, it is already- it is- the little bit of lag is completely fine. I'm not a professional gamer yet. Nope, I am not. I'm about to chase people with a chainsaw. Enzo, what is going on? What trouble are you having, my friend? I need to go mining for obsidian. Oh, actually, no, I don't, because there's water here and there's lava right there. I could just get water and dump it on the lava. That sounds like a brilliant idea, Sai. Let's go do that. So then I can make an enchanting table and make an enchanting room. Oh, Dead by Daylight. I was like, I thought you were really annoyed at your neighbors or something. Uh, okay. Get a bucket. Where are you? Bucket. And just go get some water, dump it on the lava, and we will be hunky-dory. I should probably connect my mind to my bunker. That would make sense. Sometimes you just gotta chase people with a chainsaw. Yep, absolutely. It's called self-care. Hello. I also think this version of Optifine is not as good as Forge Optifine, but it was Forge Optifine that refused to work for me yesterday. And so when I was just like, uh, trying to get it to work today, I was like, eh, I don't want to deal with Forge Optifine, so I'm just going to put on this one. And it was successful. Ooh, underground. Same brain cell. Yes, yeah, same brain cell. Uh, no, okay, I need to get above it. I'm pretty sure. Is that how- is that how obsidian works? My ears being weird. Okay. Only source blocks turn into obsidian? Okay. So I just got one. But I only need four to make an enchanting table, and there is more lava over here. I could actually grab the lava and then... Hmm. Ooh, fancy swamp. Wait, where's the lava? Hang on. Oh, it's over here. Okay. Oh, pumpkins. Nice. I'll grab some. There are a lot of lot of lava p pools in a plains biome. <laughs> Sorry, lava pits. See, that one actually works. Lava pit sounds perfectly valid. Uh, water pit, on the other hand. Sounds like somewhere in where you dump a body. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. No. 
Okay, well that was a disaster. I I lagged and the lava no, the lava lagged and so I didn't realize that it was not safe to stand there. <laughs> I love how that's where your brain took it. Well, I mean, what else would you do at a place called a water pit? Like Maybe I should just go down into my mine and try and find lava down there. At least this girl is on fire. Yes, absolutely. At least you moved out of the way. Yes, so I can still get my stuff. Drink? Uh, what do you mean? Oh gosh, there's 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 stone right there. I am just gonna leave that. A diamond sword. And my armor. Uh oh, that's the rest of the stuffs up there. Drink out of a water pit? Why would you drink out of a water pit? Out in the wild, like a lion. Uh, sure. Where's my diamond pickaxe? And my diamond axe and my diamond shovel. Excuse me? Oh no, oh no, okay. My obsidian's up there. How did my obsidian get on the freaking tree? Oh uh, gosh, this is absolutely a disaster. Um. Ha, huh, no, please stop. It burned, dead. No, it can't be. Alright, this was a terrible idea. At least I have diamonds still. I think I have enough to make a, a replacement pickaxe. Well, alright. Maybe I, sh I should have just gone into the mine. At least I didn't lose my leather. I started a forest fire? No, I didn't. There was only one tree over there. I lost all my levels! Ugh. This is terrible. My disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. Oh, not the sword, the coal. There we go. You can look in the cave you found near the first lava thing. Eh, or I could just go down to the mine. I think it'd be easier and less dangerous. Uh, what am I doing? Diamond pickaxe. And diamond axe. And more wood. I need a I need an iron shovel just so that I have a shovel. Uh iron shovel. There we go. This should be fine. At least I didn't lose any of my armor. I kind of need more coal, which is weird. Oh gosh, there's pillagers outside. I lost my shield. I lost my shield. I need a shield, and then I'm gonna go fight those pillagers, because there are pillagers outside my house. Don't take the axe with you mining. That is... yeah, that is a very good idea. Uh, 
Murder time! Oh, wrong thing. You. Come on, go down the ladder. Thank you. Nope. Thank you. Where'd you guys go? You over here? Pillagers! Hello? I think they're gone. Oh, no they're not. They're over here. Oh. You got another banner! BRB, I'm gonna go get soup. You go get soup! I'll be here. Oh, I'm gonna fight these guys at night. I want your banner. Voluntary exile. I got bad omen. Yay! Uh, thank you! Uh, just a name for the follow! I need the banner, I need the banner. Go, 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 go. Uh. Give me a second. There, there's a bot. Hmm, that's weird. I'm trying to get rid of the bot, and it's saying that the username doesn't exist. Ooh, I got a crossbow. Fun. I should really add more chests up here. Uh, chests up here. No, I have bad omen. Yay. I should get some- I, I, I can get some milk and get rid of that. Hang on. Let me just put this back over here. Did you make sure it was typed correctly? I did, I did it twice. There we go. No more bad omen. Alright, we're gonna go looking for lava. Underground. Underground lava. Match is over. How'd you do, Enzo? Yeah, a bot. I tried to ban the bot, but it didn't work. So we just have to deal with the bot uh, message being there. Oh, there you go. Okay. It wouldn't let me do it for some reason. We got an advertisements. <laughs> Swinging the band hammer on the butt. Goodbye. Huh, skeleton. Okay. Lava pops. Is there lava this way? Hmm. Kind of need more torches, but it's fine. Hello, I am back and with soup. What kind of soup? Also, Enzo, how'd you do in your match? Aha! Uh -huh. I sense that I am near a cave. Did 
Three out of four killed. Uh, is that good? If that's good, well done. If that's not good, better luck next time. All right, need to go back. And then mine like this way. Oh. Ta-da, I'm underneath water. Where are you? Where are you? There you are. There we go. Entering another match. Good luck! What is it, Enzo? Everyone has a med kit. Ooh. to pick up some iron. I do not have much left. And I should also get this coal, actually. Don't fly in front of my pickaxe, bat. Caves always stress me out, so that's why I'm not really talking right now. I don't want to lose all my stuff. Valid caves are stinky. Yeah, they are. They're great for pi finding all sorts of cool stuff, uh, or just lots of stuff, but also stinky. Okay, now that I'm safe, I'm actually going to do something real quick. So, I don't know if I can do it from the- the- so... Just give me a hot second. Pull up my I need to make Psy luck bingo cards. Oh, absolutely. Let's see. Yeah, 
there. I think that worked. Should have. All right. Just don't want any monsters spawning. Hey there, bats. I do not know where I came down into here from, which is not good. To say the least. I'm not trying to get back up quite yet. But. Still haven't found a spawner. I have not. Where's that zombie sound coming from? There's a creeper down there. Also a lot of coal. So I'm going to deal with the creeper. There we go. I think I should have enough iron. But you can never have enough coal. I also have not found a mine shaft. That was the other- <laughs> On my other solo series, I started it off and immediately found a mine shaft. Oh, that was me that placed that. I was like, oh. I also haven't found a desert temple or a woodland mansion. I found a desert temple on BGDC. But a mine shaft that leads to a spawner. Yep, those tend to come together. Oh, there you are, Mr. Zombie. Hearing you for ages. Anything in here? Don't think so. Would like you. Coal? Happened twice to me. And how many disc 13s did you find? There's someone lawn mowering right outside the window. Come on! Aha! Lured him into water. Come on, really? Like, no lava in here? Hey, found another one in an abandoned base. We're cursed! I'm also out of torches. Shields are a lifesaver. I love them, especially when I'm having when I'm dealing with a bit of lag. Kill the creeper, kill, kill the creeper. Drop a music disc. No. Well, she was there. Yeah, I remember that. You guys were yelling about it in the server. I think I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go back up. So I am out of torches. Hey, I got one. I got one uh, obsidian. I just need three more. Never expected obsidian to be hard to find. I'm probably 
Match is over. How'd you do, Enzo? Uh, you'll probably find a lava pool close to your base. Probably. Now, the question is, where did I come from? Was it... Here? No. Great job, Enzo! Also, I, I gave you the, the v VIP badge. Because you're cool and you've been here for ages. Where did I come from? Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? The whole... The, the whole that I was trying to make that into something and it didn't work. Where is my hole? Help, I can't find my hole. It was in this area, I'm sure. Come on, where is it? <laughs> Hi Roy, you can always dig up. I know, but I was attached to my mine. So I should be able to get back through my mine. Underwater? Oh, it was underwater! Thank you! Thank you, Enzo! There it was. Haha! -ha! You can finally use Twitch again! That's great! Happy to have you! Oh, and I got a bow from one of the skeletons. I have almost a stack of iron. How oh, you vibe with us. Yes. That sounds so sinister, but yes. Oh, is it Rui? I don't know, my brain always gives me Roy because that, that's an actual name. But it, it's Rui, isn't it? Is it Rui or Roy? Don't, don't, please, I'm being lied to. It looks like Roy, it just, it just does. Ooh, I got two bows from the skeletons, actually. Uh, I'm gonna sleep. Okay, it is Roy. I was right. X was wrong. <laughs> I like my water bottle. I don't remember where it came from. My dad gave it to me. It's from a school somewhere in this country. Because my dad gets water bottles from schools and stuff. Let me put this down. There we go. But I, I have no idea where it's where it's from. So that makes it a very interesting story, of course. My dad could tell me where it's from, but I'm not my dad. Any more torches? That's what I was going to get. Our whole relationship is a lie. Uh, it's probably because of- this is gonna sound really weird, but it's probably because of the uh, Winnie the Pooh character that's Rue, and then people just add an I on the end, so it's Rui. That's probably what people think, but it's not that. Welcome back to Pronunciation Wars with Siren CN! Yeah, it's been ages since we've had one. Oh, lag. Perhaps building a house with ladders was not the best idea when my computer lags sometimes. Yeah, uh... Um... 
Blink blunk. What am I doing? Door also is a double O, but you don't say doer. Well, not with that attitude, you don't. Okay, what am I doing? <laughs> My shield is half durability. Welcome back to English pronunciation is stupid with Cypher and CN. It's my first language and I hate it. Though, at least it's uh, when I speak English, it's not completely uh, incomprehensible. There was one time when I was speaking French uh, with my class. And I just had to read something out of a book in French, and when I'm speaking French, I roll my R's. And I there were so many R's in that sentence that the sentence was no longer comprehensible. And my teacher had to get somebody else to read it because my class couldn't understand. Speak French, do it. Sorry, Simon. So it is. Sorry, Simon, so it's true. Oh, don't even get me started with French. Speak French, do it. What do you want me to say in French? I could speak French. I need my hoe. It's on the- it's in the other chest. French commentary challenge, go! No, I don't- I, I don't- I don't speak French that well. French stream, baby. Uh, I don't think that would be very nice for anybody. There are so many chickens! <laughs> there are so many chickens! Chicken and duff ants. I don't know. There are so many ex the hearts in my face, and so many chickens. <laughs> They're so loud! Oh my gosh. These cows must be going insane. the chicken sounds. Oh, no, let me out. There we go. I have... I have so many eggs. I'm just gonna need, like, an egg chest. <laughs> you can't hear me over the really, really loud chickens. Hang on, I'm gonna- I'm gonna fill my entire- I'm gonna fill my hopper up with eggs and just eat them all in here. The chickens have taken over! This is the chicken stream now. Every time I lag while I'm near the chickens, I think, oh gosh, I've finally done it. I've broken my computer with the amount of chickens. <laughs> French chicken stream! Uh, chicken in French is... Uh, poulet. I don't know if it's all chickens or just cooked chicken, but it's poulet. Yay! French chicken stream.
<laughs> now this is commentary. Thank you, chickens. Are you guys staging a coup? You gonna take over my stream with chickens? That was the worst bird pun I've ever done. <laughs> okay, anyway, uh, moving right along. I need more obsidian. You can probably get lava from the nether. That's actually really true. Though I did spawn in a very unfortunate place. Yeah, uh... It, not unfortunate. I mean, I'm very happy with my spawn. I just mean, like, in terms of getting, uh... That actually looks doesn't, doesn't look bad. In terms of getting lava. It's going viral. You can't be a bird-themed streamer without making some bird puns. I need more food, actually. You can't be a bird-themed streamer with ma making constant bird puns. It's just required. Absolutely required. I can make bread. More bread. So I have a lot of wheat. Oh, that's- no, that's my iron. Like, I have a lot of wheat. Here we go. Now I have less wheat, but I don't have very many cows anyway. I thought I was hearing ominous music, but no, it's the guy on the lawnmower again. <laughs> I thought it was like really ominous music. It, but no, it was just the dull hum of the lawnmower. Freaking lawnmowers, man. I'm gonna go this way. I have a good feeling about this way. <laughs> lawnmower, man. Take me by the hand, lead me to the land. <laughs> I don't know why that's where my brain went immediately, but... Chicken in Portuguese is galina. I don't think I pronounced that right, but I made an attempt. Wait. Chicken in Spanish is galina. Quick, exp what's chicken in Hebrew? We're gonna get chicken in- chicken in every language. My dad has this song that he does, this chant kind of thing, icebreaker style thing he does when he speaks sometimes, uh, that is a song that involves saying the same thing in different languages, but it's just numbers. It's just numbers 1 to 18. Uh, but here we do chicken. So instead of something simple like numbers, we do- we do chicken. Of course. <laughs> Oop, here's a mineshaft. Oop, a spawner! Oh look, the end portal! That- is that really how it feels to watch one of these streams? Tamegolet. I did not pronounce that right. I know, absolutely not. I did not. But... I tried. This is a multilingual stream now. Yes. Uh, say comme ça. It, it, it is what it is. You didn't even read the word correctly. Yeah, I did. I just didn't pronounce it right. Man, you'd think with my luck it'd be easier to find obsidian. Or, you know, just lava pool. Y yeah, that's what you put. Uh, 
I'm I'm so confused. Oh, <laughs> uh, no, it isn't. The R and the N bled into each other. Tar Tarnigolet. Oh boy. I am not going to try to read that because it's a language I don't know and so I will A, butcher it and B, be saying something that I don't understand. But thank you for sharing. That was adorable. What? The emote? The emote is adorable. I would like to say, just as a fun fact, I I made a race of creatures for a story that I'm writing, and they are completely just self-indulgent. They are literally a race of bird pirates that have a language based on French. It it they're French bird pirates. Is is like it's a race of me. Portuguese is easier. To, how you said it, Portuguese is easier to understand when you know Spanish. Yes, and Spanish is actually easier to understand if you know French. They're all related, but I don't know Spanish. I only know French, and so me trying to speak Portuguese would be a disaster. I feel like he either said something really nice or really, like, not nasty, but, like, weird. So, but I don't understand it <laughs> at all. Like, I can make a little bit of a guess. I know Spanish and I can assure you that's not true. W what do you mean? Well, I mean, it's easier to learn Spanish if you know French rather than, like, German. I can I can make a little bit of a guess at, at some of the words in what Enzo said, but none of the important ones. Google Translate it. Like, right now? Do you want me to do it right now? Or Oh, diamonds. And I can hear lava off to the right. I suck at French, even though I tried so hard. It really, if you get a bad teacher, it's really difficult to learn any language. I was lucky to have a really, really good teacher, really good teachers for French. Wait, hang on, I don't hear it anymore. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Okay, it is in here. I'll do it now. I might as well before I forget. I'll just pull this over here. Why does it wanna it, what? It was it was auto detect instead of translating into English. It decided that it wanted to translate into Kiswahili, and I'm like, w why? I picked up German way better than I did with French. And all right, okay. And I only learned English because of YouTubers. Okay, let's see. Copy. Oh, that's really nice, actually. I, I, that's, that's really nice, Enzo. Oh, thank you. All right, okay. Okay, back to regular schedule programming now that I'm smiling really, really hard. Um... Lava pool! <gasps> Yay! Woo!
I was just saying German because my mother is a French teacher and knows German. So, like, I don't know. I always hear that French and Spanish are not, like, super similar, but similar enough to be able to sort of, if you know one language, you can make guesses at the other. And that it's it's slightly easier to learn, but I've never actually taken Spanish or anything, so I can't attest to that. I've learned a little bit of Gaelic. I did I did Scottish Gaelic and I did Latin for a bit. I know really really common useful languages that I chose, of course. Only useful languages learned by Sai. <laughs> Uh, but then I gave up on both of those. It was just a lot of work, and I'm still learning French, so I, you know, just stuck with that. And then with the whole uh, global situation with Miss Rona, it... Yeah. I know how to read Arabic, but I can't for the life of me understand or speak it. Uh, I, yeah, I don't know anything that uses a different alphabet. That, that seems like something that would be really, really hard. The thing with French is that the way you write it and the way you pronounce it is way different. That is true, but the pronunciation, unlike English, does tend to have some kind of rule. And if there are exceptions to the rule, there's like a list of exceptions that you learn kind of thing. So, like when you're doing, when you're doing passé composé, they all use the same, the same verb, and then there are a list of exceptions that you learn. It's not like you just have to learn every one individually. I have more obsidian than I needed, but that's fine. Miss Rona flushed. How do we get to this topic again? Uh, you asked me to talk about. You asked me to. I mentioned the R's. Uh, I was speaking incomprehensible French. Yeah, it was something to do with the chickens. I don't even remember. <laughs> the French chickens. I guess the French chickens. Speak chinkin. I can't speak chicken. It's like bark, 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 bark. That's chicken. I can't speak chicken. I can speak French. And I actually can speak a tiny bit of Spanish, but it's like the tiniest bit. It's like I can say the numbers one to five. Uh <laughs> Look amazing. Okay, I'm gonna make an enchanting table. And then we can make an enchanting room. Down in my bunker. Woo! Okay. Just need four of you. Excuse me. Do it, say it, speak it. In kindergarten we learn the chicken goes kukuriku. Uh, I don't think that's right. BRB, see you, see you in a moment, Enzo. Spanish chickens. Can I make a book? I should know how to make a book. I've made many of them. Both in Minecraft and in real life. Uh, it's paper and leather. I'm trying to think of a, a good Spanish uh, bird joke. I don't know, but I don't know enough Spanish. <laughs> and I don't want to be offensive, so I don't want to try and like come up with a joke and risk it being offensive. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna make an enchanting room now, downstairs.
Yay! Yeah, here we just learned that they go cluck. I gotta make more furnaces. Your chickens are interesting. Ours just go cluck. <laughs> uh, something in Spanish from Roy. Media share stream, but all we send is how to pronounce videos. We should do a just chatting stream where you guys try and make me say stuff in different languages. And see how well I do. Wouldn't that be fun? A uh, creeper just walked right by my window. Cool. Please, I'd love that so much. Uh, sure, then. Uh, how about next Thursday? <laughs> do you want to do a, a multilingual stream next Thursday? Nobody waits for the Spanish hen, ominous. Oh, by the way, Roy, if your Twitch is working again, then you should follow my stream so that you can tune in at other times. Ha 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 ha. Shameless plug on my own stream. Where did my torches go? They're there. It's a date. Yeah. Not like a literal date, but you know. You can you can say it's a date and have it not refer to a romantic date. That's that's how the word works. You know. Has more than one definition as words do. Anyway, um You already were. Oh, okay. I didn't know. I couldn't remember if you'd been to a stream before. Alright, now this one can be one wide. So we're gonna... No. We're gonna go in here. Expand out to three... Because the enchantment setup is an odd number. Now I need to open this up a little bit. Shh, let me have this. I've been following since January. I was a few times, but I was quiet. Well, we are glad to have you here, whether you are lurking or if you are chatting. I don't know what I'm doing. This, this is what I was looking for. <laughs> Silent Roy. He do be silent though. I don't know why, but my brain always likes to give me songs whenever people say things. And usually it has something to do with what was said. Uh, but this time it was just memory from cats. I was like, okay, okay. Sure. What does that have to do with Roy being silent? I have no idea. Alright, let's figure this out. I know it's a little dark. I just need to figure out what I'm doing before I put down any torches. I think I could put one here for right now. So, go in. And if I put the table there, that should work. So, hang on. Let me just see. If I put the table there, then I need to have bookshelves here, here, and then so I need to go out one more. Cats, yeah. Memory all alone. I don't remember the words. Do 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 something like that. I don't know. 
It's one of those songs that you're just like, you belt out the one word and then you're like, uh, I don't know what the rest of this is. Okay. Bookshelves. Around. And when we're back. I believe. Someone yell at me if I'm, if I'm doing this wrong. I think- I think this is big enough. Uh, no, I want to move this back, actually. It is big enough, but it's going to be a little cramped. So I want to push it back one more. Cats is actually- well, it's not a good musical. It has good music, but the musical itself is a little- it requires, like, a suspension of brain cells because it doesn't actually have any plot. There, that should be fine, I think. That's- that's- that's fine. That's fine, right? Block away on every side. Alright. <laughs> Suspension of brain cell. Yeah. Andrew Lloyd Webber has some actual good musicals like Joseph and well, well, like Joseph but some of his musicals have good music but like either no plot or plot that doesn't make much sense. If you're gonna watch Cats, don't watch the movie. Just don't. Watch the actual production. The actual production is really good. Like, in terms of, like, state, like, in terms of acting and the songs and how the stage is set up and all that, but the movie is... I, well, I haven't seen the movie, but, mm, you know. But I mean, Andrew Lloyd Webber did Phantom as well, and Phantom's plot is a little, eh, as we were talking about a couple days ago. Oh yeah, I saw the musical, I meant the movie. Yeah, I haven't seen the movie either. What did I do there? What did I just do? I only watched Jack Film's film frame by frame movie trailer analysis. That sounds like a headache. If I'm being completely honest. I will probably end the stream soon. Just a heads up. Yep, there's one dare too. Surprisingly a very entertaining hour and a half. Enzo says he's back. Welcome back, Enzo. Uh, by the way, what pronouns do you use? I was using- I just said he, but I am not sure. And I do not want to get it wrong. Oh, those are torches, not stone bricks. As soon as I finish this off, I'll probably end the stream because I've been been going for a while.
don't know if I have enough to finish this, enough bricks to finish this, but I still have some stuff smelting upstairs. I now have agony from Into the Woods stuck in my head. You know, that's another musical I haven't seen, Into the Woods. Uh, I think one of the actors who was in Cats, the movie, was in uh, Into the Woods, the movie. Uh, James Corden. Wasn't he? James Corden was- it, This is such a random thing for me to know, but I feel like James Corden was in both Cats the movie and Into the Woods, even though I've never seen Into the Woods. I feel like I know this. Yeah, cause he did- he did seven musicals- he did- no, he did like 20 musicals in seven minutes with Lin-Manuel Miranda and Emily Blunt. And they had been in Into the Woods together, and so when they were doing Into the Woods, it was the two of them doing their solo from the movie, and then Lynn Lynn kept showing up in the background as, like, a tree, and he got really, like, faux annoyed because uh, Lynn was trying to, to steal their song. Anyway, uh, random stuff, random trivia from me. It was a really good video, actually. Lynn as in like Miranda? Yeah, that's what I just that's what I said. Lynn Manuel Miranda. Look it up. It was a really good video. Uh I think it was 20 musicals in seven minutes. Uh, but it was the James Corden show with Lynn Manuel Miranda and Emily Blunt. I think that's her name. The the lady or the lady who's the new Mary Poppins, it was her. I know like four musicals, so I wouldn't know. I grew up on musicals, but I didn't grow up on popular musicals. I grew up on the Pirates of Penzance. Mostly. I grew up on Gilbert and Sullivan. Pirates of Penzance is my favorite musical ever! Favorite movie ever as well, and it has been since I was a little kid. It's really good. But then I also like some of the other Gilbert and Sullivans, such as HMS Pinafore. I don't think I finished watching the Mikado, but the Mikado, from what I saw of it, was really good. Uh, Trial by Jury is so funny. I watched Trial by Jury... I've seen Trial by Jury twice. The first time I saw it was just at my house. And the second time was, there's a recording of it on YouTube in like high definition because they're so old that they don't have any copyright on them anymore and so it also it means you can post them on YouTube, it means that you can perform them without having to pay any, any, pay anything, uh, any royalties, that's what it's called, without having to pay royalties because they're so old. So they get performed a lot and they also, like I said, it's a video on YouTube, and it's, it's not actually a bootleg, it's a high-definition just YouTube video of the performance. And so that exists, and there was one class, like, two years ago, uh, where I finished all of my work, and I still had, like, an hour of class. And Trial by Jury is a mini-opera, so it's only, like, an hour long, instead of your usual- it's, it's only in one act, it's only, like, an hour long, instead of your usual two acts, an hour an act. For musicals. So uh, I watched Trial by Jury in class, the whole thing, without stopping, and it was it was so entertaining. Trial by Jury, I'm just gonna go on a tangent about this now. Trial by Jury, if I remember correctly, is a musical about uh, it's about a legal case, but I don't remember 
what the legal case is actually about. I just remember that the defendant and the plaintiff were in a relationship and the it has to do with like they broke up. So it might be like a divorce legal divorce trial of some kind. Uh but I don't remember but it just it gets it gets weird. But it's so so funny. There's a creeper right outside of my door. There you are. Ah. Uh, you know, maybe this maybe this hole is a oh. Maybe this hole is a problem for future me to deal with. I'll put it on my to watch list. I can actually like send you the video. I can find it for you on YouTube. Because it's by it's the video that I'm talking about is by the Australian Opera Company. It's it's really good. But I don't know if it's actually in its own video because it might be at the end of the their HMS Pinafore production. That might that might be how they did it. Because sometimes they do that, they perform one musical, and then if they have a smaller musical, they just stick it on the end. Because I remember it is the same actors. So I don't know if it's a different video. I'll have to I'll have to look it up for you. Now I'm gonna move my face cam because it's just like up I'm gonna move my face cam up by like two notches. There we go. That's better. I think. No, it's not. Hang on. Oh no, that's the game. You. You can come up too. I think that should be fine. Is that okay? Does is that good? Anyway, okay. I said I was gonna end the stream, and then I got off on that tangent about musicals that I like. So I will end the stream. Actually, we've done. Uh, a relative lot. If making an enchantment table is a lot, I died, which doesn't happen. It hasn't really happened. Is that the first time I died in this entire series? I think it might have been. Hmm. All right. Well, this is my last stream for the week. I don't stream on weekends, so uh, I will be back on Monday. Mondays are my test stream days. Excuse me where I test out new games. So I will be playing Slime Rancher on stream on Monday. Uh, Tuesday, we'll be back in this server. Wednesday, I will be doing a final Minecraft Dungeon stream. Hopefully it'll be the last one where I do secret levels and stuff. Thursday, looks like we're just gonna be do, doing just chatting, maybe? Just sort of hanging out. Uh, and then Friday will be solo Minecraft again. Yes, yeah, Slime Rancher. Yes, that's gonna be that's gonna be on Monday. An honorable first death. It was not. It was me being stupid and the lava lagging. Whoops. So, thank you everybody for coming to my stream, and thank you to everybody who followed during the stream or between this stream and the last between last stream and this and this stream. And I will see you all next time. I think. I'm gonna raid someone, if I can find someone. If my friend is still alive, hopefully she is. Yes, yes she is. All right, epic. So, let's go. I'm just gonna have to meet myself there. There we go. I'll see you guys over there in a moment. <laughs>